Good morning, beautiful people. <laughs> it's day 75. I am so happy. So happy to be done. I 75 hard is like a roller coaster, you know? It's a roller coaster. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy to share my last day with you. Today's video is a full day of eating on 75 hard. And it is brought to you by Bill Bar. So I'm very excited. And I'm more excited that 75 hard is done. It's done, it's done, it's done, it's done, it's done. I need to make some oatmeal, so let's go do that. <sighs> so it's time to eat that oatmeal. It has been an interesting last few days. For one, I'm just exhausted. I'm very, very tired. And two, like the way I do my outdoor workout almost every single day, pretty much every single day, except for a few, is I go hike right by my house. Well, that's no longer possible because it's blocked off. So that's been a struggle. And then yesterday I was taking my picture and I just knocked my camera over. Like I had I had an old camera that like is falling apart, so I was able to still take my picture. It doesn't it doesn't look like it's that bad, right? But this doesn't go in and out, and the screen is completely, completely gone. So I don't know. I don't know if it's repairable, but this won't move. It doesn't move in and out anymore. That was really rough. That was really rough. Not to mention just all of the other anxieties and things, but we're doing it. We're making life happen. We can eat this breakfast. All right, we are headed out. The babies are in the back and we're just headed there. Isn't that right, sweet chips? It's okay. We're going, we're just waiting for daddy. We're just waiting for daddy. <laughs> I love them so much. You say take me on a treasure hunt. I long for something new. Have you heard the fairies when they sing and dance? Oh, I wish it was me. I was kind of a dummy twice. I um, didn't know that it looped because on the front side it gives a mile and then on the back side it gave a mile. And so I was like, oh, we must just be going to a destination and then coming back the same way, which is why it has like the different, the mileage on the front and the, the different mileage on the back. And so I left my shaker bottle because Chips needed my full intention. And um, I just was carrying a lot. I didn't wear a jacket or anything. And so I set it down thinking I'd be able to go pick it up. While the hubs, when I believe, like we had the choice once we met up to like go back the way we came, which he didn't want to do, or um, he or I could go back and get it. And he's like, he really wanted a good run and running with the babies is good. Walking with the babies is good, but it's easier to do it without them sometimes especially new places like they wanted to smell well julio did really good hub said but chippy just wanted to smell everywhere she wanted to smell everything so it made it a little bit of a challenge anyway he's ran to go grab my water bottle for me so we shall see we shall see how long it takes <laughs> and how he feels and if he regrets his decision to go after because i told him i would go I would just need to walk it so it would take a wee bit longer. He can run a mile a lot faster. So, anyway. Oh, and the other thing that I did is that normally I would bring built bars on something like this and I left my built bars home. So, I do want to go ahead and chat about built bars. 
Thank you, Built Bar, for sponsoring today's video. And for making it possible for me to film all of my What I Eat in a Day videos this month. When we go hiking, on a road trip, or even if I just know I'll be out and about all day, I'll pack a Built Bar for me and the hubs if he's with me. We love the way Built Bars taste. It's kind of like an Almond Joy, or my sister compared it to Valentine's Day candy, and I thought that was really good, especially for the salted caramel. I really like that the protein keeps me satiated until my next meal. I'm not a big snacker and I really don't enjoy feeling like I need a snack. So I, I love that about Built Bars. If I have a Built Bar, I know I'm good until my next meal. My husband loves that he gets extra protein, but Built Bars are gentle on his stomach, unlike a lot of protein powders and such. Also, it's a guilt-free treat with a low calorie nutrition profile with calories only ranging from 130 to 180 calories all with at least 17 grams of protein. My go-to bar out of the 17 regular flavors are the coconut almond or the salted caramel. I also like the double chocolate. It has 130 calories in it. My husband loves the German chocolate. I really enjoy that they are portable and that their low calorie, high protein nutrition profile make them a perfect option for a snack and a pinch. To save 10% on purchases while this promotion lasts, click the link in the description below. So the hubs and I went out for lunch and we went to a place called Pito's. He got a pizza, I got a steak salad. It's my favorite salad right now, aside from the Bravo salad. The Bravo salad from Cantina Bravo, if you're familiar with this area, is my most favorite salad. It's almost like not a salad though. There's like lettuce in the bottom, but then mostly it's just the vegetables and a little bit of shrimp and a little bit of chicken. It is so good. Um, anyway, we went and I got a steak salad, which it's literally just lettuce, tomato, steak, and then it is whatever dressing you choose. And I usually get ranch. And then I always ask for it on the side. Pretty much anywhere I go, I ask for dressing on the side. With the Cantino Bravo salad, I don't use any dressing typically. And then with the steak salad, I usually use ranch. But if you don't tell them to put it on the side, it comes with like, it's too much. It's way too much. It's way too much and it's way too many calories as well. But I, I'm just tired. I'm so ready to be done with 75 hard. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna talk more about everything in my 75 hard review video and that will go live the Wednesday after you see this. So this will go live on Friday and then the following Wednesday will be my 75 hard review and results video. And I really have loved 75 hard for the most part, but I think I'm just tired. The last 15 days have just been, each day I feel like it's harder than the day before, but I keep showing up and I keep doing it. And that surprises me. It surprises me that I'm able to still show up and to still do it. Um, the diet is probably the easiest part of 75 hard at this point. Taking the picture, I always almost forget it. Drinking the water timely throughout the day has gotten harder. Um, getting my workouts in in a timely manner. It's easier when Yana and I work out in the morning, but because of our schedules and stuff, like especially our spouse's schedules, it's just been hit or miss on if we get to work out sometimes. And when I do it on my own, it's not that I don't work out or that I don't enjoy working out or that it's hard for me to work out because I love working out. <laughs> I do with or without anyone else. It's just without having that early morning workout i tend to push it and then i run out of time like and i've never ran out of time it's just it's like oh well now it's like seven o'clock and you have two workouts to do so and then with 75 hard you're not supposed to do them like back to back so there has to be time between and i'm like oh yay so now i'm staying up way late which I mean, honestly, if I do 75 hard again and I've thought about doing it again, I've thought about that it might be a fun challenge for me to do just every January. Maybe not every January of my life, but like in January, do 75 hard um, just as something to focus on since those months typically are harder on most people, especially with them making me get outside, which if you've watched my channel, you know that I try to spend at least 15 minutes outside anyway. So I'm like, this is, goes way back to the beginning of my journey. I try to spend 15 minutes a day outside, um, whether it's playing ball with my pups or whatever. I just think it's good for your mental health, um, for my mental health to spend at least 15 minutes a day, 15 minutes a day outside. So I don't know why I went off down that rabbit hole. 
today. I've still got to edit Wednesday's video and I need to edit this video. And we have family coming into town soon and I need to like get that guest room ready and it is a struggle to get the guest room ready. It is a struggle. And she wants to play. Yeah. Clearly our height did not wear her out. Julio, on the other hand, he's just like laying down. Oh, I just said his name. Now he's getting up. Are you tired? Are you tired, sweet boy? Yeah, so he went with my husband. My husband ended up doing like seven miles. I did almost three on our hike earlier today. I think I did over three. So what happened is our we got a call. I got a call that I had to take. And when I took my call, I paused my workout. And then I started my workout back, but not until I had gone like 30 minutes further. So I, I did over three miles because what my watch was tracked was like almost three miles. And then that was three quarters of a mile that it didn't track. So that's quite a bit. That's quite a bit of walking today. So I th Apple watches are just amazing. I really... I'm sure Apple Watches aren't the only ones that like show everything, but just everything. I want to know what, what the weather is. I want to know what the weather is going to be in three hours. I love my Apple Watch. I think it's time for me to stop chatting. I've been chatting for eight minutes. I don't think I'm going to leave eight minutes in for you, but I've been chatting for eight minutes. So for the rest of my day, I've got to edit. Um, I am about to eat a built bar because I didn't have one on my hike. So I'm very excited about my little snacky snack. I feel like no matter what we do lately, we end up eating out and I think it's just, yeah. I'm ready for us to get everything over with that's coming up the next several months so that I can just talk freely and I don't have to worry so much about what comes out of my mouth. <laughs> oh goodness. So if you don't know, my husband is in the military and not only is it smart for me to delay some information um, or to skew the dates a little bit? It's imperative, like it's required. And it makes it hard because I'm vlogging and I want to just be able to speak freely and instead I'm having to like filter everything through, through all of these filters. So it'll be nice when I don't have to do that. But I will be very happy to feel a little bit more settled over the next couple weeks. And I think being done with 75 hard is going to allow me to feel so much more settled. Like with 75 hard at this point, I just feel, I think I already said this, I just feel exhausted all of the time right now. And I didn't think because I'm not going like right this point, I'm not even doing like if I wasn't doing 75 hard, I would probably be doing five workouts a week and then occasionally doing other stuff, but I would be pushing pretty intense on those workouts. I'm not even pushing intense anymore. Like Natasha Ocean work plan, kind of we faced it out towards the end. And so I've just been super lax in my workouts. Super lax. Anyway. Give me my belt bar. So next time I see you, I will be in the gym. My CD got jammed. What it is, what it is, what it is, what it is. <laughs> there is no more to that sentence. It does not continue. Just <laughs> uh, tired. Just uh, tired. Uh, why you do that? You drop me like who that? And put me through that? My baby is useless. I'm living my life. Don't need you with mine. Me feeling just fine. One of a kind. Who better than I? Hey, 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 oh. Shot you don't play that game. Shot you don't play that game. I won't keep you safe. Time that I read, okay? I don't play that game. Shot you don't play that game. Shawty, I know my Got a lot to do, I got a lot to do
do, I got a lot to do. At the crack of dawn in the dark of night, I got a to do. I'ma make it loud, hold me to scream like a cat. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What the boy can do? What you expect? I'm living my life. Don't need you with mine. Me feeling just fine. One of a kind. Who better than I? Oh, 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 oh. Shawty, don't play that game. Shawty, don't play that game. I got a lot to do. Got At the crack of dawn in the dark of night, what I got to do? Got to do. I'ma make it loud, how I made you scream like a cockatoo. Squirrel. Turn the party web, about to show the rest what the boy can do. What you expect, yeah. how I forget these thoughts of you. Yeah. Don't need no reps, I'm in the jet. Okay. Fly the cool, fly cool. Oh, that is, that's Shot probably actually It presses on to your... Keep your I have loved working out with Yenna. Yenna has been my best workout buddy. We have been so consistent and I think it's because we push each other and we show up for each other and for ourselves. Like neither one of us are constantly pulling the other one into showing up. And it's just been such a huge blessing. I'm so grateful for her. I'm so grateful for the progress that I've made and just being able to enjoy working out and having a friend to do it with has been wonderful, especially with all of the things that, you know, have happened in the world the past year or so. So I'm so grateful. Recently, I've gotten some requests that I slow the workouts down a little bit. So that's what I've done here. We did, we did a quick circuit. We did rocket jumps, followed by med ball tosses, followed by step ups on each side, followed by invisible wall slams, followed by one arm snatches, followed by a wall sit and windmills. And we did windmills in there as well. And then some burpees. So it's just a quick circuit that we ran through. We did not do it timed. We did it, well, the wall sits, we did timed everything else we did rep wise. And we just ran through it four times. So we kicked our butts. We kicked our own butts mixed with the deadlifts from earlier. It was a really great workout and we really loved it.
So I hope you enjoyed watching it a little bit slower than usual. I hope those of you who have requested that enjoyed it. And yeah, that was our workout. I am cooking dinner right now. I just made a mistake. Like, so I did the chicken and then I did the broccoli and then I just dumped the broccoli in with the chicken. I know my hubs is gonna hate it, but whatever, it'll be fine. And then we're gonna do that on rice. So chicken, broccoli, and rice. Yum, 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 yummy for my tummy. And then I'm still chugging along on my water. Anyway, 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 <laughs> I'm so tired. It is, it's gonna be a good dinner. I'll see you when I'm eating. Alrighty, so I am gonna go eat my dinner. I'm gonna watch Fear of the Walking, Fear of the Walking Dead? Yeah, Fear of the Walking Dead. The Walking Dead is over. <sighs> I'm very excited. I'm very excited to wrap this day up. Still have water to drink. Still need to read my 10 pages, but I'm gonna enjoy dinner and um, the hubs and I are gonna watch a little, a little show. I will see you guys a little later. almost done with my water I took my picture earlier I didn't record it um I don't know if I ever recorded it actually but this video is gonna be a little bit different than the other two like the first 25 days and the 50 days because I am on Wednesday I think I already shared this doing my review video so I don't want to give too much of my thoughts and opinions away just enjoying day 75 and I'm so exhausted. I'm so exhausted, y'all. <sighs> 75 hard has been exhausting. I am so proud that I have, in about three more sips, completed all of my obligations. That does make me so happy. But it has been rough. It has been yeah it's been wonderful at times and i'm so happy because i feel like these habits that i feel are going to carry me they're going to carry me through this upcoming move that we have they're going to carry me through the rest of my journey like i'm just going to keep adding to these habits and making my life better and that makes me so happy but it's also a challenge it's a challenge The water is done. I can go to bed. I hope that you enjoyed watching day 75 of 75 hard. I am more excited to share my overview. Like today, although there was awesomeness to it, I'm, ex I'm exhausted and it kind of sucks. <laughs> right now, 75 hard sucks. There has been points of this journey where 75 hard was like a dream. I'm like, oh, I love doing this. I love doing these things and checking off my little list. But now, I'm just over it. I'm over it. I really, at one point, like, I think I even talked to you guys. I'm like, I just want to start over so I can just do it forever. <laughs> I'm so dumb. I get so dumb sometimes. And when I thought that I wanted to do 75 hard forever, I was dumb. I do, I do to take elements of 75 hard and do them forever and we will talk about it we'll talk about those things but if you enjoyed today's video please give me a thumbs up subscribe if you want to follow along on my weight loss journey and i will see you guys soon love you bye